Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm meteorologist Adrian Vaughn with a look at the tropical forecast. And we want to take a look back before we look ahead head because today a pretty important day. It's the day that we had tropical storm Allison move through parts of our area. It's the first tropical named storm to be retired without ever reaching hurricane status. 40 inches of rain fell across our area and over seven 70,000 homes were flooded because of this storm. So it's certainly one to remember. I know a lot of folks here in Houston do remember this storm from 2001, 22 deaths, and most of those died whenever they were in their vehicles. This is why we say so many times, turn around, don't drown. You don't wanna be in a vehicle whenever you've got flooding occurring across the area. So something that we uh, certainly don't wanna look back on and, and have happen again. Luckily, nothing like that in the forecast for us here uh, as we head throughout the course of the next several days. We are still monitoring what's happening with potential tropical cyclone one brought in some very heavy rain across parts of Florida. Some locations there across South Florida seeing upwards of six to 10 inches of rain. Now that storm has reemerged back into the Atlantic Ocean. Uh, uh, the latest check the four o'clock advisory showing winds at 45 miles per hour, but it's still not quite a tropical storm, and that's because the center of circulation with this is still very elongated and, and disorganized. It's starting to become a little bit more organized than where it was earlier on today. So we'll have to see some of the uh, longer range forecasts still anticipating this to become our first named system, first tropical storm of this season. But at this point, it's going to be right over all of the Atlantic Ocean could impact Bermuda as we get down the line, but uh, certainly not a concern for us as we move forward in time. And if you've got friends or family in Florida and they've been dealing with the very heavy rain and flooding there, this going to be winding down and wrapping on up and heading out to sea as we head through uh, the rest of this weekend and into early next week and see it picks up quite a bit of speed as it moves forward towards Bermuda. Our first name on the list, Alex. So that's what we will be watching uh, as we head through the next 24 hours. If that does become a, a tropical storm, the first name again, Alex, and that's what it will be named. Uh, you could always tune in on air and get the very latest forecast for us here across Southeast Texas. And if you are so inclined, you can go ahead and download that Fox 26 app as well, and you can connect with us on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram as well.